we are going on a very exciting trip. We left this morning on our road trip to go visit Penn State. So I'm super excited. We've been in the car all morning. We're about in the middle of Virginia, which is super exciting. I'm here with my dear father who is driving the car. We will be seeing lots of him in this video. The last time I visited campus was back in 2021. I'll insert a picture here. I'm very excited to go see it again. So how are you doing today? Tell us. I'm super excited. Sure. I'm gonna take you guys along our journey of this little multi-day trip to explore State College. Thank you. Thank you. I said thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Bacon. Thank you. Yummy. I'm gonna give you guys a quick hotel tour. So when you walk in, you have this cute little sitting area with these little paintings. And then here's the bathroom, which I will show you in a minute. We have this cute closet. It's like pink on the inside, very cute. And then we get over here, we have the two beds. The pillows say we are on them, which I feel like is very cute. We have our TV with this cute little console dresser, this cute lamp, this cute chair, with a Nittany Lion lamp. And we have this full length mirror over here. So here's the bathroom. If you come in here, we have this gigantic lit up mirror. These ice cream cone wallpaper, which I think is so cute. And this is the shower. It looks super nice. So I'll take this opportunity also to show you guys my outfit. My top is this navy sweater vest that I have over just a black long sleeve. My sweater vest is from um, Macy's I believe and then I just have some black Fabletics leggings on basic, but I think it's super cute We just got back from the basketball game, which was really fun. Unfortunately, we did lose, which we're not gonna talk about. I got this pom-pom at the game, and now we are back at the hotel for the night. So this is where I'm going to leave you all, and I will see you in the morning. Good morning, you guys. So today is Monday. We just woke up about an hour ago. We went and got breakfast at the hotel restaurant and now we're just getting ready to head out for the day. the Berkey Creamery. We've been walking around campus all morning. I got chocolate chip cookie dough ice cream and my dad got tin roof sundae I believe it was called and they're both super good.
would you rate the ice cream out of 10? It was like a 9.5. I agree. It was like a 9.5. That's a good rating. So we're back at the hotel now. It is currently 2.40. We've been here for probably a little less than an hour now. We did lots of adventuring this morning and afternoon. We walked 5.3 miles today, if it will go in focus. We went a long way and covered a lot of ground. So now we're back. We've just been relaxing and preparing to venture out into the world. It's supposed to snow tonight, which is exciting. We'll probably just look at that out the window, but still the thought of it is good. Back at the hotel now. It is currently 7 11. It has been so many hours since I spoke to you. We went to the airport. We got salads at this place called Fiddlehead and it was pretty good. Now, on the way home, we got boba. I got boba. It's very good. I mean, just do it. Is it loud? No. <laughs> We'll edit that out. Yeah, but the boba tea is very good. I would give it a an 8 out of 10, which is pretty good. I used to work at a place that sold and made boba, so I'm pretty obsessed. And now we're in for the night. Not really much else going on here. So I guess I will just see you guys tomorrow then. So I thought of something else that I wanted to say. My computer's over here. 
processing my files but I realized I never told you guys about visiting the airport or gave like any context about that I am in the process of getting my private pilot's license so we wanted to go check out the airport situation here one thing that is really cool about Penn State is that there is a Penn State sponsored airport here at State College so we figured while we were here we should go check it out so this is the shirt that I got it says Penn State Aviation Center on the front and then this is the back it has the little plane graphic and then it says we are aviation on it good morning you guys it is Tuesday today today is the day we have our official tour visit the accepted students program for the College of Engineering which I'm very very excited for we got up on getting ready trying to get out the door because we don't want to be late here's the outfit of the day of this jacket which is from Patagonia which is my mom so shout out to her for making me bring this a black long sleeve and some black yoga pants with my Air Forces and this cute little hat with a pom-pom on it. I'm gonna interject here, Charlotte from the future. It is currently 9 38. I realized when I imported this all onto my computer that I literally didn't speak to you guys one single time today. There was literally no context as to what was going on. I figured that I would walk you guys through what happened today because it was a very big and exciting day. When we left our hotel this morning, we got to see that it did in fact snow some last night. It didn't snow very much, but we did get to see snow on the ground on our way to the hub building where our tour was supposed to start. So once we got to the hub, we checked in. I got this bag, and then I got this black lanyard because I'm in the College of Engineering. So I wore this around all day long. I also ended up getting a free Penn State Class of 2027 t-shirt. So then at 9.45, the information session started. It was cool because it was like a panel of students and they talked about all their experiences. Next we went on a walking tour of campus. A lot of it was things that we had already seen yesterday but it was cool to get some more information from our tour guide. She was super awesome and answered all of our questions and we got to go in some and see what some of the classrooms would look like. So our tour ended at Redifer Commons where we got to eat at the buffet for lunch. We had to wait in a very long line but eventually we got into the buffet. We got to eat there. And we got some ice cream which was super yummy which was from the creamery i got pumpkin pie flavor which was super yummy and my dad got vanilla after that we ventured back to the hub where the college of engineering specific stuff was about to start we managed to get there about 15 minutes early so we hit the bookstore where i picked up this hoodie actually the one i'm wearing right now then we had the college of engineering information session where an academic advisor spoke and then some students spoke about their experiences with studying abroad, internship stuff, which was very interesting. After that, I departed away from my father to a student-only engineering facility tour. We got to go into a bunch of awesome buildings that they have here on campus. It was also cool to see all the labs and maker spaces. After that, I made it back to the hub just in time to head out on one of the residence tours. So my dad and I ended up walking all the way from the hub up to east and we got to see the residence hall tour room. The way the demo room had it set up, it had renovated on the right and unrenovated on the left. So it was cool to see the differences between the two. Obviously both of them have the beds and and the desks and the wardrobe setup. But it was cool to actually see what the furniture looked like and what the differences between the two were. And as you can see, I made sure to try to look in every place that I could to see all of what the dorms would look like. After that I was feeling quite hungry and honestly my energy level was very low. So we stopped at the market to get some food. Then we drag ourselves all the way up to the IM building which really isn't 
far away at all. They were doing tours of that building, so one of the girls took us around. After that, we walked ourselves all the way from the northeastern end of campus at the IM building to the southwestern end, which is where our hotel is. After that, I honestly just laid in bed. I was so exhausted from the day. Right next to our hotel is a Noodles & Company where we ate pasta for dinner, which was super yummy and honestly the comfort food that I needed. So now that brings us here to the end of the day. Today, I walked 9.1 miles. I don't know if it'll focus. So I'm going to probably pass out soon. So I will see you guys tomorrow for a travel day home. Obviously, many hours later, it is currently 8.43 p.m. and I am home. I just wanted to come on and end the vlog. This was a super exciting weekend. I had so much fun going on this trip and I hope you guys really enjoyed watching it. If you are considering going to Penn State or if you just want to see what I have been up to, just wanted to say if you made it this far into the video, thank you so much for watching. I love you guys and I will see you guys in the next video. Bye! How do you end videos?